There really is quite an artistic touch to this, and I think our biologists, as well as our design engineers, they have a real heavy hand in shaping the artistry that is habitat restoration. It's, it's, it's been a long time coming. Very happy that it's happening this year. I'm Andrew Tolliver. I'm a senior biologist, and I've been working on the Carmen Smith Project for over 20 years. My name is Val Chang, and my official title is Hydro Project Engineer. Been at eWeb for about a year and a half now, and it's been a really great experience. So this is the Lower Carbon Bypass Reach Habitat Enhancement Project. We are adding habitat material into a portion of the Mackenzie River, the upper Mackenzie River, going up um, towards Blue Pool. And the purpose is to create spawning habitat for adult bull trout and adult chinook, and also increase the rearing habitat for juveniles, bull trout, chinook, rainbow trout, and cutthroat trout. So it's a big habitat uplift. And the helicopter has been picking up material, uh, the spawning gravel and the treetops from a staging area up on the hill. And they've been flying down to the river at the different work zones to deliver the material. The Upper Mackenzie River is almost devoid of naturally occurring gravel. It's a very young stream. Just upstream of here, we have lava flows as recently as 3,000 years. And so part of what we're doing is creating that habitat. And this is particularly important as we head into more and more climate change and we're looking at fish to continue to move further upstream to, to be in colder and colder habitat. So it's definitely a resiliency piece to make this a climate refuge for, for fish. It's certainly not, you know, you must place this log exactly here. There's a biologic fit to it that I think our team handles really well. So I find that, yeah, both challenging, but also interesting. Got a great team here supporting that. And I think ultimately it makes for a much more impactful end result. And it's just, it, it's that coming together of all the elements that make it really, really exciting and to watch all the habitat projects go in. We did reservoir habitat last year. We have one reservoir habitat project going on this year right now. This is going in and then we have more reach habitat going in over the next several years. So it's, it's really happening all in a short period of time. And it's, it's pretty exciting to watch the transformation.